if I'm tired of this damn box. Don't think I'm not. Because I am. It is no weighted companion. If you need my help, you just need to call me, Mr. Wayne. I will help you stay on the path through my personal hell. Can I just leave your personal hell? Subway network somewhere below the city. Here it is. Take a look at the photograph. It won't be difficult to recognize the son of the rat, but be careful with the other men. The living are just as dangerous as the dead. Didn't give me my gun back. Asshole. Sounds like the rat was following us from the moment we entered Seattle. He's offered me a deal. Save a son and he'll tell me where to find my friends and family. I have to make my way through the subway station to get topside and find his boy. It's a fair deal. He did save my life. Let's see. They've sent a message warning the poachers. Ben Parker, an acquaintance of the town, made a phone call to the warden's office. It seems he saw some hunters in a protected sector. Ben's a good guy. I think he's the only man in town who I can talk to. I saw him in the mountain, and he's not one to look for trouble. He's often come to see me, and we talk about this and that. He's a man of the world and easy to get along with. On the way back, I came across a van parked at the side of the road. Two girls were on the shoulder playing like little kids, playing and laughing. I've known those idiots for some time. They're always hanging around. The younger one, a tan, chubby girl, couldn't stop smiling. She didn't say anything special, unlike the other one. They're from Vancouver, and were looking for plants that help to cure goodness knows what illness. I've warned them. The forest knows how to find its food. It's not safe for girls to go in the forest and pick flowers. Wild animals do their job, just like I do mine. While they were leaving... Over the engine sound, I could still hear the girls laugh. I hate city people. And I don't know what happened here. It's only a couple days later. Appears to have lost his shit. Huh. Something about his migraines. Anyway. These drawings are different from the previous ones. They describe the bombings that affected the city at the beginning of the epidemic. Mm -hmm. More learning. Suck it, zombie. Oh, Jesus. I hate you so much, rat. Sprint like a bastard. When the epidemic spread to Seattle, the people made a stand, tried to fight. Many died, and then returned to consume the few that didn't. Then the military tried to fight back in the shadows. Look around and see how it happened. Looks like it didn't go very well for him. K.A. Bianchi. I don't know that one. Some of them were fairly obvious. Not the right way. Okay, 
Apparently I still count as having found it. When in doubt, run like a bastard. Ghost, get out of my damn way. When in doubt, run like a bastard. Oh, okay. Ah, I see it. Of course it moves on its own. Why wouldn't it? These soldiers, the new law. I told you, when times change, men must change. We all make choices, Mr. Wayne. In chaos, some choose to show the best sides of themselves. Ha! I was trying to hit the duck button, but I hit B, which is usually my duck button in video games. <sighs> oh, you game. You just like making me reload. Well, it's got me in the butt. <laughs> this drowning animation is pretty hilarious. Well, it's good to know how that works. You don't get a chance to jump out or nothing. You just did. Activate the thingy. good though. Maybe a little more to the left. Hmm. Whole damn thing over again? Yep. This ain't gonna get old. Actually, that gives me an idea. How far can I jump from here? Okay, so... About here, I think, ought to be good. Yeah, I like that. We'll find out. Easy peasy. <coughs> now what? Oh. Didn't even know I could do that. See, folks, you don't need a tutorial for, for everything. Innocent people who tried to look for a safe place during the Great War against the Shadows. They were crushed to death by a landslide called Bombing. 
Too much crap moving at once. Okay, hopefully it's back to normal. Oh boy. Okay, well that wasn't so bad. How deep did that old bastard take me? I can't go on. Follow this path going up, up to the old subway station. When you get to the outside, look for the house that grows in the tree. I can ask the before platform those now. men do. And I'll help you find the ones you care for. Subway cars, that's a good sign. Last entry in the tire, one of the sire fibers hit on the ground. Before they lost hope. Like the rat said, we Shit. all make choices. This isn't up, this is going back down. That was a bad choice. Like the rat said, we all make choices. He chose to build a nest down here in the aftermath of the war. Some might call it survival. Ah! Others, denial. Who never, never gave me my weapons back? God damn it, rat. Oh god. Oh god. Nope, he doesn't care. He doesn't care about the slingshot. Wee! Wee, I said. Ha <laughs> ha. You are no match for the Wii. Oh, I see what else. Over here. Herp to derp. Boy, they're stupid. I mean, that's... That's powerful stupid. Need to get to somewhere I can take a break at. So hungry. Hey! Status update. This is probably a good place to House that grows in the tree. Those were the rat's words. Anyway, uh, that looks good. That's my status. If I find a son, the rat will tell me where to find my friends. I don't feel safe above ground anymore. Being hidden is giving me perspective. This new law is worse than the shadows, to be honest. I fear for his son. Nothing about this world is safe anymore. He's in danger. I must find the house that grows in the tree. But anyway, uh, yeah, we'll be back with more of this game. That's probably a terrible idea. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> <laughs>